Hey everybody, day number four in Europe, and I have seen several hubcaps here. Here's one of them. Hopefully the stick will able to help me get this out. Oh, what a shame it's been ran over. So this is no take. Since they're a huge pain for me to take, I'm only going to take the ones that are worth it for me. Here's a second Volkswagen. Don't know what this one is. Let's check it out. Whoa, 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 whoa. See, this is why I'm using the stick rather than going over to that side. Don't know what that was, but I just saw when it flipped over what it was. I think it's a Volkswagen. Okay. It is indeed a very, very scratched Volkswagen. I might take it. I don't know yet. Oh, shoot. I lost my stick. I'm going to need that, though. got out that one and I got my stick back so that's cool this is an opal looks like 16 or maybe 17 inch not sure okay good it's intact and doesn't look like ran over so if any of you knows what this is then please do tell me because I am from America and I don't know what any of these hubcaps are but they're gonna be going back to America with me in my suitcase. Here's the Opal, a nice one. And it's all intact. I think this might even be a 17. I'm not sure. Or maybe it is a 16, but all the cars around here have tiny wheels, so I'm used to seeing 15s and 14s. I don't know. This one is a Renault. I'm able to get it by hand. Thank you to the stick. He sacrificed himself for the good of these hubcaps. For the rescue attempt. Here's the Renault. Wow, the first thing that stands out to me about this one is that it's very, very lightweight. So I am gonna take this one as well. Now what I need to do is get over to the other side because over there is where I saw another hubcap. 